guys one reason why i am in london today is because we have an event to attend to a special day for my eldest daughter so look at me i am preparing myself to attend this event so guys another special celebration for the whole family and thanks to the man up there for all the blessings we are off to the law society hall that's where the uh, ceremony will be so we are catching a bus from lister square going to holborn see you there guys hindi man lang ako hinintay ng driver maupo bago siya umandar hindi din niya alam na meron taong ang balance ay hindi mabuti so, did not even wait for me to sit down before he started to drive off I actually miss riding in the bus it's been years that I haven't used the bus here in London and yeah. oh it's quite funny we missed the stop huh? we missed the stop oh my gosh so there you are we missed the stop so, are we going now? Next stop and then walk backwards? We can go there. What? Where is the place? Okay. And the other side? Well, let's go. Let's get off here then. Yeah? Press the bell. Press the bell. Press the bell. Ding dong. This is where we're going, yeah? To survive London, I have to wear my sneakers. So we're done with our lunch, walking, crossing the bridge, and we're going to find the place where the ceremony is going to happen. We don't know yet where it is, we just know the name of the building. So ah, I'm so proud to be the mother of my children yes they are uh, they are always trying their best to make sure that they make their parents proud yes one thing that I will just share with all of you let the let the kids choose what they want to be when they are in university do not dictate anything to your children when it comes to the courses that they want to take it's because if they are happy because they were given choices they will work so hard to be successful and that's what I did to my kids I just advise them I just make them realize and share my opinion but at the end of it it is always them who make the decision if it's not going to work for them then that's it they have to learn so there's nothing perfect at the first instance 
so if they will make mistake they will learn from it and they will work hard to make it right by themselves and that's what i want to share with all of you so guys i'm so happy daddy you're also happy for our for our children yes yes we are so proud we are proud parents and we are only here to support them even though that sometimes you know filipino moms you will understand what i'm trying to say but never mind you know unfortunately they're already raised in a westernized country and the culture is totally different from what we have in the philippines but don't forget you can still instill a little bit to them just reminding them where they come from because that is very important guys we are now in the law society hall so we're just waiting for the ceremony at about three o'clock in the afternoon we just been to the um, picture taking so we had a very nice picture taking again and also me and alex has been taking pictures in the stairs so it was so lovely that we're having this time together and i also have a beautiful picture with mr mags look at that that one see look at mr mags he looks so handsome <laughs> I'm going to take the opportunity that I have the access to the main library of the Law Society. So let's have a look. One is done, so one left. <laughs> Isn't it, Dad? Okay. 